Hi there, I'm Tony Carter. I play Kino the Stripper. <laughs> I'm the stripper at the beginning of the show who's a part of a Chippendales troupe coming through town that gets the ladies all kind of amped up and sort of plants the idea in the main character's minds about maybe doing a strip show to make some money. GP, they would think I'm obsessed. Who? The ladies? You don't know? I mean, if I, if I do what you think, you know, like that. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I think it'd be pretty funny. I actually did a good chunk of research. <laughs> Lauren Blair, the director, who's fabulous, sent me a bunch of uh, like 80s Chippendale videos. There's actually like a VHS direct to home, tall, dark, and handsome. It's like an hour long <laughs> Chippendales video uh, that we watched. That was pretty, it feels very funny and dated now. Um, as well as uh, a little bit of Magic Mike and <laughs> trying to get some inspiration about melding the sort of 80s, 90s world that we're setting the show in, as well as some contemporary sensibility and what is it that is uh, exciting and sexy and masculine about Strip that I wanted to embody and, and bring to the character. Well, I've got a show to do. This time I'm John Wayne, go figure. But hey, he's working at the mall. One of the things that I really love about The Full Monty is it allows our characters to start at a kind of cringeworthy level of relatability. A lot of the men come from a very blue collar, rough background, and even faced with things like meeting characters who are gay, viewing that as antithetical to masculinity. Even the idea of doing this strip show for the main character, Jerry, is, is like most of these strippers are gay and they want to see a real straight man. And when you hear him talk about what what is a man, for him, the list that he rattles off is a man drinks beer and wears boots and he cuts the turkey. And as Jerry in particular, but all the men go through the, the journey of the show, you see them realize like a man is someone who is true to his word. A man is someone who takes care of the people in his life. A man is someone who can be trusted and relied on. And the sort of community that these men form, they learn that being a man is much more than being manly. We put you business on through out to Casey. I'm going to be doing the weather for WXXI in Rochester. Oh, don't want to lose my seat. Break that. <laughs> the audiences have been really, really great. <laughs> They're really fun. I think a lot of people come because they've seen Naked Men on the poster. And so we get a lot of that really like, woohoo, a lot of woo girl energy, <laughs> which I need at the top of the show when I'm coming out and like stripping off my fireman outfit. Uh, but there's so much heart in the show. And I love, I love watching the audience go from like, yeah, take it off at the beginning of the show to really caring about the characters in the show and falling in love with them and cheering for their successes and wanting them to succeed. And then we bring them back to the end where now they're going, woo, take it off. But it feels so much more like we're championing these, these men who have really struggled and gone through it and now we're rooting for them and in their corner. So I think audiences come with one expectation and get so much more than they bargained for and in the end get everything that they were looking for.